In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to combine different edges together to create your own unique shape of your own making. Basically, you can go underneath any of the edges effects and use the same technique. For this purpose, I'm going to go underneath Painted Edges. Select it, and by default, a painted edge appears on screen. I'm going to select the Select Edge Effect button. I'm going to come over here and peruse through and find an edge I'd like to apply. Let's try this one. All right. The first step is we come over here to the Clone Edge tool. When we click on screen, essentially what's going to occur is the edge which we've loaded up is going to be cloned. Now, the photo is not cloned inside the edge, just the edge. So as you see, I can drag this and reshape it, and in essence, change how the mask looks on the photo. So as we move it along, we can get all kinds of different looks. I'm going to go in and I'm going to choose a different type of edge. And we'll choose something with a little bit more wisp along the sides. So in essence, you can see how that looks. I can grab my other edge and independently transform and shape each one to create the kind of look I'm after. And in this case, I'm going to shoot this off the screen a little bit to create some tension. And basically, that's how you do it. It's a fairly simple technique. Again, you load up an edge effect and then you use the clone edge tool. And you can clone as many different edges as you like to create different com combinations of effects. Some of the more popular techniques are to combine dark room with painted or you can even combine your vignettes uh, with more solid looking edge effects.